or they do something like they, you know, try and push a phone into a case that they bought and it shatters the screen face. You see the, the it's more than a finger width here versus the finger width here. See the difference? John Naylor here with a little update. We've got this fabulous Lenovo Legion 5i. We've been doing a lot of video editing here, so we pulled in a second screen. This is an old one that I had lying around the house. The problem is, is the size of the zoom that I operate on. So the size of the pixels on the Lenovo screen are this big, tiny. And then this old monitor, which is 1920p. Well, you can see the, the it's more than a finger width here versus the finger width here. See the difference? So anyway, this thing's operating at its maximum resolution. So we've gone to the massive expense, shopped hard, and we found this little bad boy. So this is a Philips 27 inch monitor. And what I've done the research on is that what this actually means is that the pixel size, the actual tiny pixel on this screen is the latest technology, which equates to the size of the tiny pixel on this thing. So what I'm looking to do is when I put this in place, I'm expecting the toolbars to be the same size here as here. Hope you've enjoyed my bit of van life there. Let's have a look inside what's in the box. Okay, nice box, huh? Okay, we've got a base stand there. Let's get that out and have a look at that. Yep, that's obviously the base. I'm not gonna use that. Got a HDMI cable. Looks like it's 1.5 meters or thereabouts, standard length. Got a quick start guide. Got a uh, important information manual. To teach us not to hurt ourselves. We got a smart uniformity data sheet at shipment. So there we go. We've done the checks to see that it's all operating in spec. We've got a Australia warranty card because that's where we are, Australia. Gold Coast, Tweed Heads. I'll go for a surf later. Standard Australian power cord. What's this one? Okay. Okay, won't be using this either, will we? Now it's interesting here, I might find some other purpose for this though, because as we see, that's a visa mount and a tape measure, yeah I do. That screw bit there, that's 100 millimeters, okay? You can see that, 100 millimeters, the so standard 100 mil visa mount. Won't be using that here, will we? We've got, uh, there's gonna be the bolts, the little thumb screws to fix it in. We've also got a universal Allen key with a Phillips head on the end. Probably not gonna use that either. Let's have a look at the actual product. Isn't it terrible when you see those people doing those unboxing things where they've been sent an iPhone or think they've been sent an iPhone, they get it, there's no iPhone in the box. Or they do something like they, you know, try and push a phone into a case that they bought and it shatters the screen face and then they get upset and throw the phone. The uh, unboxing fails, it's just hilarious. Okay, energy rating, 103 kilowatts per year. If you leave it on, I guess, the whole time. What do we got? Port-wise, let's have a look. So you can see PowerPoint, two HDMI, we've got a display port, we've got an external speaker port as well. Now, one of the great reasons, also Kensington lock there as well, one of the reasons I went for this one and not the others is that no matter the HD or very HD uh, resolution that I wanted, it's also this one actually, and there's a couple of different models. This one's actually got some two watt speakers in it. So it's two by two watt speakers. That price was Umart Australia, October 2024. And the price was $359 with a few bucks for delivery. Took two or three days to get here.